welcome back to my channel. We are going to make a card today using a Darcy stamp set called Sweetie Pie. It features a pie, a bag of sugar, and a berry with some great sentiments there. I also wanted to share my finished card. I used the Dreamy Witch from Not Too Shabby. I did some no line coloring with Copics and colored pencils. I added some Doodlebug stickers to complete this card. So that turned out really cute with the stickers. Really easy way to add some embellishments. I'm going to be using some distress inks for the background here. I have my images all colored up and cut out. I want to color these little squares here with my distress inks. I'm going to add this pattern paper to my card base. So what I did is after I colored my images I went through my stash and found something that would match nicely with those colors. So I chose this paper. I'm just going to add some glue to the back. I'm going to add some glue to the back of my frame. So for the bottom piece, I'm going to be using tea dye. And for the top, I'll be using Seedless Preserve. And I'm using the Picket Fence Life Changing Blender Brushes. I love these brushes. They're so um, easy to use. And I want to do kind of of an ombre. So more of the brown on the bottom and then I will fade into the purple. So I'll pick up some of that purple color. Dab off a little bit on my palette here. And then go back to my vintage, or my tea dye color. And blend those two together. really really pretty and I will do the same to the top with the brown on top and the seedless preserve on the bottom go back to my brown I love these inks for blending. So let's get my card base back. Then I can stick down my panels. So let's add a little bit of glue to the back. I added the liquid adhesive so I could wiggle it around if I need to. Okay, now that I have my placement where I want it, I can start adding my images and my sentiment. So I want to pop some of these images up. I'm just going to add 
a piece of foam tape to the back. I'm going to put this in the corner. And I'm going to need two layers of foam tape. Make sure it's straight. I'm going to have my tallest image on this side to balance out the corner here. So I'm going to add two layers of foam tape on the back. And make sure that the foam tape is going to fit. Let's see, we want the little feet. Let's see, do we want the feet inside? Or on the outside? And then we'll have these two guys snuggling up together. And now let's add some sequence. Let's see, I have some purple sequence. Let's see if this looks... I don't really like this sequence. Let's see what else I have. Gold might look good. white Let's see what the white looks like maybe this one will look good So that completes my card. I hope you enjoyed it. Thanks for stopping by my channel today and I will catch you guys in the next video. Take care guys.